Well, good morning, everybody. Welcome to Trail Hunter USA. Uh, me and the girls left out. This is East. This is uh, not Easter. This is Good Friday, uh, 2024. Me and the girl. I'm off today, so me and the girls decided to head out and come down to the lake last night. We're on the inside the land between the lakes. We're on the Lake Barkley side. We got here late last night, and uh, so I didn't film anything uh, getting set up, but we're here this morning, just woke up, and going to have some breakfast and stuff. It's a really great spot here, I found. I've found it before in the past. It's a little bit of high grass, but it's a nice little area right here on the lake. You'll see from the video from today. We're going to kind of today just have some breakfast uh, set around the lake here and that for a little while and then we're going to uh, head out and just investigate some more trails here in the lbl i've been here my whole life but i haven't spent a whole lot of time in the lbl and uh, i haven't been on all these trails uh, we went through some pretty good deep holes this morning uh, last night trying to get trying to get here so uh, we should have a fun day i uh, can't do anything too extreme today because i'm by myself but we will probably get in a little trouble here and there and there's a place here called hotel california i may go try to find it i never have been to it you, there's a you got to walk to it a uh, walking trail so we'll see but we're just going to have fun today glad you're with us
It's a beautiful place here. Men and girls are just going to kind of walk around this morning. Just finished up breakfast. <clears throat> Made me a little coffee. And going to walk around and sip my coffee with the girls. I hadn't said before, I think this is trail 331. Not 100% certain on that, but I'll double check it. I'll start trying to mark my trails I go on and the campsites and everything. I think I'm going to start a, either a Patreon account or probably a Patreon account. Uh, YouTube has something that you can become like a member of the channel or something, but a little bit frustrated with YouTube. I mean, I've got 32,000 members and or followers and I still can't get on there to get any kind of uh, pay with my video. So, uh, you know, I'm not making anything from YouTube. If you guys think I am, I'm not. Um, so, uh, I'm basically making them money, people viewing my channel and everything, but anyway, not frustrated. I did this because I wanted to, but I think I may try Patreon, but if I do, what I'm getting around to is, uh, I'm going to start, um, uh, putting Gaia, I'm putting on my maps and everything on Gaia maps. And I'll be able to uh, hopefully get those to you all one day somehow as I figure this out. So keep watching the channel and hopefully before long I'll have a Patreon where you can join and we'll have a member area. And I'll give you all the campsites that I go to and all the trails that I'm on. And things on that end is going to start picking up because, uh, like I said, I'm going to be retiring from my regular job before long. And it'll pick up even more, so. I said 331, it's 330. But this is the mud hole when I first, after, right after I got my Bronco, I came down. And if you haven't seen the video, I'll try to put a link to it up in the top corner here right now. But when I hit this spot right here, I sank and that was it. I had to winch out of it. It doesn't look that bad, but that's a deep hole right there. One of the problems I had, I was trying to straddle that side and this right side, it right in there is like probably five foot deep or something. And if you saw the video, <clears throat> you saw it. All the water flowing into the bronco debbie on her side had about six to eight inches of water on the passenger side and i got fortunately if you're in the lbl if that happens it, i hopefully i highly recommend a winch if you come through here and you're going to go through these mud holes because you never know how deep they're going to be but there's plenty of trees to winch off to so that's what we did winched off to a tree and got ourselves out but that's really a comical video i've got some shorts on it and also a full video so i may just link the short up here uh go check out my channel to see the rest of them though
Well, it's 9 a.m. We've had a great morning together, men and girls. I think I am going to pack up the rig and we're going to go hit some trails in the LBL and see what we can get into. This is going. what I mean you don't know about this mud here and the LBL you got to take each mud hole got mud all up in my Bronco <clears throat> okay we just found a great camp spot pretty good size you get two or three at least two or three rigs up here on a hill it's really cool it fall probably early spring while the leaves are not on the trees Got a great view of the lake and the woods. Girls can see the squirrels a long way off and chase them. <laughs> okay, another good camp spot. Come down to the end here. There's a double spot actually. You could camp where my Bronco is and then somebody could pull in here. We've got a little beach down here not a whole lot of trash i'm not even going to, if, if i pull up on one and there's a ton of trash i'm not even going to mark it people are stupid this has got a little beach on it shells i'd say you'd have to get here early if it's in the summer Cause this one's not that bad to get to. You could probably walk over to that across here as a bar, you see. So that'd be fun out here in the summer. That's where we camped over there. You see that green buoy? We were right there camping last night. Again, this is Barkley Lake here. These lakes are beautiful and I'm thankful to have them close to me. I need to get out here more, have fun.
Sometimes you're going down one of these trails and you just know when to turn around. No way I'm making it under that. I've got a chainsaw, but there's no way I'm trying to solve, solve that. So turn it around. Found a little area here called Empire Point. Got some old barns. Used to be a working farm at one time. All this area I'm driving through now is where a tornado ripped through the land between the lakes. I'll caught it late. I'll try to get some good photos, but just trees down everywhere. to guess that this is the trail to Hotel California because that supposed Hotel California is all graffitied up just like this so I'm gonna guess that that's the trail so we're not going down it though I don't care nothing about it on the west side of the scenic parkway and it leads down to a little lake here it was marked uh, closed November the 5th through March the 15th uh, I guess it's a wildlife reserve or something uh, they use it as a wildlife reserve at, during those times it's March the 29th now there's a few camp spots back here And looks like there's boat access here as well. I bet this would be a good fishing lake.
driving down this 139 on the west side of the scenic byway and <clears throat> it's a long route looks like it's headed down to the lake there's several little spots it looks like people have pulled off the sides and camped it didn't look like re uh, designated camp spots but i think if you needed a spot to stop for just for the night they would be good not this hadn't been a very difficult road there was one spot you had to go around a giant mud hole i didn't even test it so i went around it but it was kind of tight going through there but other than that it's been good all right i found a killer camp spot down at the end of 139 the only problem is it's a long way here but what a campsite this is you can get several rigs in here right on the lake and there's a dam here you can drive down on it and go over in there i haven't been over there there's somebody over there camping imagine i do imagine this is a very popular place so you get out of that I don't know, it looks like maybe a pond on this side. Probably some good fish in there. Got a beach here. Well, that's a wrap for today. It's about three o'clock. I need to get back home. So had a good day, fun day. We got to find some camp spots and hit some trails. Didn't get to do any really tough trails. Did almost get hung up one time as you probably already seen in this video, but I'm getting ready to air up and head home. I appreciate you guys watching. Uh, if you would, please go ahead, like the video, share it with people, leave a comment, let me know what you think. Um, subscribe to the channel, all that stuff, and uh, we will see you guys later. See you on the trails.